hello everybody hello beautiful people hello guys hope you guys are good hope you guys are great i'm live here so i'm just gonna wait for a couple of minutes for people to join me before before i start i just want to talk about um this nollywood act um actor yomi fabi hello guys hello 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 beautiful people hello on instagram if you're there with me hello on facebook hello um yeah i just want to talk about yomi fabi i'm on instagram and i'm on facebook if you want to join me on instagram it's may's beauty palace and if you want to join me on facebook it's may egbomo you know my name and my surname so i'm on those two platform i want to talk about yomi fabi that guy is really pissing me off seriously that guy is really really pissing me off pissing me off to the core so i'm just gonna wait for a couple of minutes for people to join me uh because sometimes it takes time for people to get notification um from facebook so i'm just gonna wait hello hello from facebook and, and hello from um instagram hello hello if you're here please share kindly share and please help me to tag yomi fabi can you help me to tag yomi fabi especially on instagram i don't know if he's on facebook but i know he's on instagram can you help me to tag him please help me to tag yomi fabi i want to call and i want to speak to him a man to a woman a father to a mother yeah? a, a mother to a father i want to speak to him so please help me to share help me to tag him if you can tag him if you know his handle just help me to tag him yomi fabi hello how your joy how are you doing my sister hope you're good hope you're great i really want to speak to that guy is really really is gotten to the, my last nerves that guy is gotten to my last nerve and i really i really need to call him out and speak to him he's gone beyond he's gone beyond boundaries the guy called yomi fabi is gone beyond boundaries seriously he's gone beyond boundaries if you want to cash out if you want to cash out on a situation you don't cash out on such situation no situation like this whereby a child is involved you don't cash out on situation whereby a child is involved you don't do that you don't do that just because you are in a lawless country just because you are in a lawless country doesn't give you the right to cash out on an innocent child it doesn't give you the right what makes you okay how are you different from the person that has been accused of child molestation how are you different you yomi fabi Please, can you tag him for me? Can you tag him for me? You know, I don't really do this. If he doesn't consign a child, if he doesn't consign my community, you know, I don't do, I don't normally do this. It's not my style. You guys know me better. You know, please help me to tag him on Instagram because I know he's on Instagram, but I'm not sure if he's on Facebook. Help me to tag him on Instagram, please. I need him to come and, and hear me out here and hear me out is that guy has pissed me off to the extent that i was like this afternoon when i came back from from um from um from where i went to do some of my assessments when i came back i was like what the f what the f you have the audacity why the case is still going on you have the audacity to quick make a film just because you want to catch out you just because you want to cash out and you've forgotten that it's the only the grace of god that giveth wealth without no sorrow you have forgotten that guy has really pissed me off big time you don't cash out on molestation you don't cash out on on, on pedophiles you don't cash out on things like that you don't cash out on things like that if you want to cash out do another movie that you can cash out on not not when not when a child is involved just because you are in nigeria the, the country that has no no they they have rules they have regulations they have laws but they barely follow it even the police the, the authority people that are that, that are in those sectors they don't even monitor because who approved that film in the first place because i heard from baba latin the other time that uh mommy Esabod was interviewing baba latin he said we before a film uh, um, is so to rise to come out to be aired for you and i for the viewers to see he goes through the censor uh, board he goes through the censor so are you telling me that the censor authority or the censor board whatever they call them actually saw the whole the whole movie and actually um approved such a movie to be aired in the public i am highly disappointed as a mother this gives me this gives me cold feet you understand it gives me the it, 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 it's like somebody is just tearing my skin you understand as a mother i am highly 
disappointed and he calls himself a father. He calls himself a father. He calls himself a father. And you actually make a movie on a molestation case. Even if it's alleged or not alleged, the case is still in court. The case has not, has not been finalized yet. It's only when a case is being finalized that you can make a movie out of it. Just because you want to cash out. Are you that desperate of cash? If you're that desperate of cash, then do go for me. Tell people to donate money for you. But you don't go out and make movie and start cashing out on a child, on a minor, on an innocent girl. Very soon you guys will be saying we are feminists, we are feminists, we are feminists. We are fe no, this is not all about being feminist. No, this is all about doing what is right, knowing what is right and doing what is right. This is not ethical. In your moving industry, I'm sure this is not ethical at all. You are asking, you are asking the girl, what does the girl, a girl child wants to be? The girl child said, I want to be a prostitute. Is that the thing that you want to portray to our children, to our young girls? I'm a mother myself. I have a girl child. I was actually, and when I saw that clip, that I was actually heartbroken. I don't know how you guys feel when you saw the clip. But I was actually heartbroken. How can you? Ask a girl child, you wrote a script and you ask a girl child, what does that girl child wants to be? And you wrote the script that the girl child said he wants, she wants to be a prostitute just because you are beefing with somebody? You went below the belt, you are me for the I swear down, you went below the belt. You cannot do that. That is not good at all. What are you teaching our young children? I have a daughter. I'm sure so many of us have a daughter here. We have children, we have boy child, girl child. It doesn't matter the sex, but what are you teaching them? This is absolutely not, it, 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 it's wrong. What is wrong is wrong. Let's call a spade a spade. I am not supporting nobody. No, 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 that's not me. I'm not Yoruba. I'm not Yoruba, but I understand Yoruba. You understand? I'm not Yoruba, but I understand Yoruba. But let's call a spade a spade. Let's call a spade a spade. You cannot, while a case is going on at the court, you cannot make movie out of it. That is not ethical. That is not ethical. It is not ethical at all. This is, you went below the belt, Yomi Fabi. You went below the belt. You went below the belt. Guys, I need you to tag him for me. If you're on Facebook, if you're on Instagram, tag him for me to come and listen, to come and hear me out. Talking as a, as a mother, I'm not talking as a, as, as, as whatever, a, a, a follower now. No, 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 no. Put that aside. Put that, and as, a, 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 you, 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 the way you, the way you portray yourself, you portray yourself as if you are, you are a classic man, you are a, you are a dapper man, you are a, an educated man, intellectually sound, but I don't see any intellectually sound here. I don't see you being intellectually sound. I don't see you being an educated man. I see you being a desperado. I see you being a desperate man that wants to use every opportunity to cash out. You can cash out on things like this. If you think you can cash out on things like this, trust me, God is watching you. God is watching you. Whether that child, that 14 year old child was telling the truth or not, you wait till the court finishes their, their case. Before you come out and start doing movie about it. Not when the case is going on. Yomi Fabi, I want to ask you. Do you know that what you've done with this movie that you've done? This will make a lot of victim, a lot of victim not to say anything. Do you know that? I just want to ask you, Yomi Fabi, do you know that this, what you've done, will make a lot of victim not say nothing. They will not say nothing. Let's call a spade a spade. Whether the girl, whether the, the other party is wrong or right. No, that is not what I'm saying. That is not a contention of, a bond of contention here. No, that is not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is that the way you portray that girl child in that movie is absolutely wrong. You don't cash out when a, a case is going on. You went and quickly make a movie. Do you have you even watched the movie, Yomi Fabi? Did you sit down and watch the movie? Are you proud of yourself of making such movie? You gave a little girl. I'm sure that girl is about ten or eleven. You gave a little girl a script, asking the little girl, "What do you want to be when you grow up?" And you you wrote the script for that girl. That that girl said, "I 
I want to be a prostitute. Is that what you're teaching our children? Is that what you're teaching our children? I swear that it's just because you are in Nigeria. Supposing you are in UK or in America, you could have been picked up. Trust me, you could have been picked up. Because that is not ethical. I'm sure what, what uh, 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 the, the censor, the censor, the censor, whatever they call them in Nigeria, did not review that movie. Did not see that movie before you air that movie. Because I'm sure if they saw that movie before you air it, they will not, they will not give you an approval. It will not be approved. It will not be approved. Probably you went through the back door. I'm sure you went through the back door. Because if you went through the front door and the right authorities saw, saw that movie before you aired that movie, you would, they would not approve that movie. That I guarantee you, that movie would have, would have been approved. How dare you? How dare you pro, 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 uh, 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 make such a movie? And you call yourself a father. You call yourself a man. A man is there to protect, to guide, to lead, to set an example. You are not setting an example. That is not an example, Yomi Fabi. What you've done is actually rubbish. The movie you've done is rubbish. Let me tell you if you don't know. The movie that you've done is absolutely rubbish. It's rubbish. What lesson do you want us to learn there? What lesson do you want us to learn there? There is no lesson there. There is no lesson there. As a matter of fact, you have given enough room. You have given, like, you've given the, 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 uh, 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 the, the people that molest children, you've given them another, another, uh, uh, another strength to go on and, and do what they, or what they normally do to molest children. You've given them, you've boosted their, you've boosted their morale. You've, bo you've boosted their power. You've boosted their ego to, to go on and start perpetrating. That's what you've done. If you don't know, if nobody's telling you, I am telling you from a point, from a woman's point of view, from a mother's point of view, that what you've done, you've given perpetrators a, a, a power. You've given them power to go on and start doing all sort of to our children. And trust me, you think you're cashing out on that movie. You think you want to cash out. Trust me. You, uh, 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 um, what is it called? I don't know how to say it properly in Europe, but pardon me. But they said it's the grace of God that give it, that give it wealth without no sorrow. I don't know how they say it in Yoruba. I'm not Yoruba, but what you've done is absolutely wrong, Yomi. It's absolutely wrong. You're wrong. You're dead wrong. You're dead wrong. You don't have any excuse. You don't have any excuse to put such a movie in the, in, 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 on the internet. You don't have any excuse portraying our girl children as a prostitute. No. Do you know that if you portray one girl child as a prostitute, you're telling the whole children. Don't you know the power of media? Don't you know the power of media upon our children? Don't you know? I believe you don't know because if you know, you will not go through, you will not go to that extent. You will not go to that extent. I, 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 that, that I guarantee you, you will not go to that extent and start making such a movie. The part that really annoys me, it was when they were asking that girl, what do you want to be when you grow up? An 11-year-old and 12-year-old, you actually wrote that script for that girl, for that little child, and that child said, I want to be a prostitute when I grow up. What the? F don't let me cause. Sorry, mothers, if you're, on, if you're on this platform. Sorry, I don't want to cause. I'm just trying to bite my tongue for me not to cause. What the heck do you think you're doing? What the heck do you think you're doing? You are absolutely wrong. What you've done is wrong. And if you got nobody telling you, I am telling you from across the pond that what you've done is wrong. Supposing you are in USA or you are in London, trust me, you'd have been picked up. You have been picked up. Probably that movie will never see the daylight. That movie would have not seen the daylight because there is no way, there is no way the movie industry, maybe the people that say source movie would have approved such a movie. You actually use the the, the, the the names of the people that is involved in the in the in the case. You actually use their real name. Man, you're wrong, though. You're wrong. You're wrong, fam. Seriously, you're wrong. You're absolutely wrong. You're absolutely wrong. And you've lost you've lost a lot of fans because of this. Trust me, you have lost a lot of fans because of this. Because what you've done, you've actually shown the kind of person that you are. That you're not a real man. You're not a leader. You're not a protector. 
Because a man in our community was supposed to protect, he's supposed to protect and guide and set an example for all the youngsters that are coming. But what you've done is absolutely wrong. You just want to cash out. You are there for the cash and for the fame. Let me tell you, fame fades. If you don't know, let me tell you right now, fame do fade. Nothing lasts forever. If nobody's telling you, I am telling you, nothing lasts forever. Nothing lasts forever. You might think you're famous today, you're Mifabi, but trust me, that fame, you will regret that fame. Because if the glory of God, if the grace of God is not upon that fame, trust me, you will regret the fame. Because you see, it's as if you are dragging that fame by force. You are taking that fame by force. And I kid you not, the money that you're going to cash, you think you're cashing, you think you're cashing for, from this movie? Trust me, it's not going to yield you anything. It's not going to yield you anything. Because for, for a starter, that case is still in the court. That case is still in the court. You could have wait for that case to be finalized. You could have wait. You could have just wait for that case to be finalized. When that case is, when that case is finalized, then you can make whatever movie that you want to make. You can do whatever you want to make. But now why is that case is still in court and that case is, has not even, has not even be, have not, the judge has not even sat down to even see. The, the, maybe they will have a panel of judges, a panel of uh, 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 juries and stuff. We don't really know that we see to the case. You've not given that girl. You've not even given the victim. You've not even given the victim the privilege for a case to be heard, for, for a case to be listened to, for a case to be at, to, 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 uh, to see the daylight. With the judge. You've not even given that girl child. Seriously, what you've done is wrong. Yomi Fabi, what you've done is absolutely wrong. If nobody's telling you, I am telling you, I am not Yoruba. I'm telling you I'm not Yoruba. But I understand. But what you've done is wrong. If you're if Yorubas are not telling you that what you've done is wrong, I am telling you that what you've done is wrong. The movie that you put out or call Yabo or whatever you call it is wrong. You could have waited. Nobody is saying don't make movie. Nobody is saying don't make movie. No. You can as 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 long as you're concerned, you can make movie every day if you choose to. But the movie, the content in that movie is absolutely wrong. It's absolutely wrong. Dead wrong. You're dead wrong. You're Mifabi. You are absolutely you're dead wrong from making such a movie. You're dead wrong. Asking a girl child what you want to be, and you actually wrote that script. You actually wrote that script that the girl child is saying that I want to become a prostitute when I grow up. Is that what you want to portray to our children? That's why some mothers don't allow their children to watch Nollywood movies because they, they say it's absolutely crap. It doesn't teach the children anything, it doesn't teach them anything. That's why some mothers don't. I've heard some Yoruba ladies say, no, I'm not going to let my daughters, my children watch your Nollywood movies because it's absolutely crap. It doesn't teach anything. All it portrayed is, is immoralities that it portrays. You understand? So you've actually proven those mothers right. You've actually proven them right. Because I was like skeptical about, about their comment that, uh-uh, come on, now they teach sense sometimes, they do this sometimes. But you've actually proven them right that what you've done what you want, what they, what they are saying is actually right. It is right. If the elders in, the, in in your industry are not calling you to order, trust me, I am calling you to order from the uh, from, from from across the pond. I am calling to that 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 movie that you've done is absolutely crap, and that movie should be taken. That you should you should take that movie down because it does not portray anything. It does not it does not make no sense. It doesn't make no sense. You go and rewatch the movie again. It doesn't make no sense. Nobody's saying that. Uh, what was it called? The guy, um, uh, the guy, um, uh, um, Larry or oh, Larry something. I can't remember his real name now. But uh, AKA Baba Jesha. Nobody saying what he's doing, uh, whether he's, he's, he's guilty or not guilty. No, that's not what we're saying. Like I said before, hear me out. Like I said before, that's not what we're saying. That's not the bone of contention yet. But what we're saying is that that case is still in the courts. You should have waited. Just wait. It won't take long. Wait until the case is over. When the case is over, then you can do whatever you want to do. You can make as long as long as you you, you can do whatever you want to do. You can make two, two, 200 billion movies about it. That's your headache. That's your cup of tea. That's for you and your audience. 
You understand? But not why the case is still in court and there's a girl child involved. It's a molestation case. Whether alleged or not alleged, is a molestation case. You could have waited. You could have waited. Trust me. The luck that you have is because you are in Nigeria. Trust me. Supposing you are in England or you are in America, you could have been picked up. But I, I'm sure before they even picked you up, that movie would have not would have not even sealed the daylight. Because nobody, no any board authority will approve such a movie. Trust me. That's all I've got to say, guys. That's all I've got to say. I just need to come and vex. I just need to come and vex it out because that when I saw the clip, went on YouTube and saw the clip, it was disgusting. It was disgusting. How can you use the, 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 the real names of the people involved? That's unethical. That's unethical. And you claim you're a learned person. You come out and speak all sort of grammar, all sort of all sort of English that, that is not even in the new dictionary. It's old. Even the, the people that their, their language are English don't even use in those English anymore. They are old school English. They don't use it anymore. You come out and blap and speak all sort of English and blah 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 blah. But yet upstairs is empty. You're empty, man. It's just an empty barren making the loudest noise. Because if you're not empty, you, you claim to be an activist. You claim that, okay, you went to the police station and rally and, and, and what's it called? Campaign or whatever you, you did back then. Put placard and say, release Baba Jesha on that human, uh, you, uh, you, uh, you are infringing on his human rights. You understand that the offense that he did is a bearable offense. Fair enough. That's, that's your opinion. If that's what the court, the law says, then they should follow the law. You understand? I'm not, I'm not about that one. But what I'm after is what you've done. The aftermath of what you've done. The aftermath of what you've done is absolutely wrong for you to bring such a movie out and portray our girl child, our girl child like that. No, you can't do, you don't do things like that. You don't do things like you wrong. You're dead wrong. If nobody's telling you, I'm telling you again. You're Mifabi. You are dead wrong. You are dead wrong. You are dead wrong. How do you want mothers to be to to even leave their their girl children with you, with the acts that you've just portrayed, with the movie script that you've just written? How do you want mother to leave their girl child with you? How do you want it? How do you want it? That's all I've got to say, guys. Sorry if I haven't read your comment. Let me just go back and read comments. Sorry. I, just, I was just, you know, let me just pass my message before I forget. Before I forget everything. Sorry, guys. Let me just see what what a word is on here. Let me see. Uh, let me see. He wanted to make money with the girl child molestation. Yeah, I just feel he wanted to cash out. Bottom line on the uh, bottom line of it is he, he wanted to cash out. That's just the basic truth. He wanted to cash out. But as a Nigerian, we need to call him out. If he do, if he's done wrong, we need to call him out, man. We need to call him out that what you've done is wrong. What you've done is wrong. You can put such a movie on the internet. Do you know the power of internet? Do you know the power of media? What you've done is wrong. You don't cash out in social things. You've forgotten that it's only the grace of God that, that given wealth, or how do they say, and had it no sorrow. You've forgotten. Peter uh, said, it's not his fault now. People are supporting him. Nigerians don't um, like truth. Please leave them or God will take control. But I understand that God will take control. I understand, but let's call a spade a spade. It's, it's human being that God will use to, 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 to tell him that what is done is wrong. God himself is not going to come down and sit with him face to face and say, what you've done is wrong. Somebody needs to call him out. Somebody needs to call him out. You know me. If you've been following me for years now, you know when it comes to our children, I don't play with it. When it comes to something to do to do with our community, no, I will speak up. 
I'm not somebody that will just shoot my mouth and not speak up. No. But he went below the belt. He went below. Um, he said, you're absolutely right. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. If I don't have time to read your comment, I'm so, so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. It's just that, you know, um, when I saw the clip, when I came back from my, um, where I went, when I saw the clip, it was absolutely, I was absolutely like, what is wrong with you? You understand? You don't cash out on things like this. It's, this case is too sensitive. That is the reason why people don't come out when they, where people, when people rape them, when people molest, uh, molest them, you know, when people abuse them. This is the reason why people don't come out. You are supposed to be a protector. You are supposed to be a guardian. You are supposed, because I see a man is supposed to be a protector. A woman is supposed to be a protector. We are also as mothers, as fathers, as uncles, as brother. We don't have to come from the same family before we protect our community, before we protect our girl child. Once, once girl child is being abused, that means all the girl child is being abused. You understand? That's why I said, no, you, you, what you've done, you're me, Fabi, what you've done is wrong. You are absolutely, you're wrong. Nobody's saying, don't make a movie. Nobody's, no, 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 no. Don't get us wrong. Nobody's saying, don't make movie. Nobody's saying, don't make movie. No, that's not what we're saying. What we're saying is that you should have waited. You should have waited feel, until the case is over, then you now make your movie based on the outcome of the based on the outcome of the case then you make your movie no why is the case the case hasn't even seen see, the judge have not even speak on it they've not spoken on they've not spoken and they've not speak on it they've not done anything on it but you just went to make a movie just because you want to cash out you want to cash out you want to cash out trust me you cashing out you cashing out on this particular movie, Okoyabo, whatever you call it, is not going to bring you fortune. Trust me. Like I said before, on the people on Facebook and Instagram, like I said before, remember I said, fame do fade. Fame is not forever. It do fade. And if you eat, if you, if you, if you, if you, if you seek for fame in the wrong manner, Trust me, when you see the karma of it, you will even, you will beg God for, 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 for that fame not to be existing in your life anymore. Trust me. But you just go on and keep doing it. Keep doing what you're doing. If you feel that what you're doing, what you've done is right, leave the movie there. But if you feel what you've done is wrong, take the movie off the air. Take it off the air because that movie is absolutely insane. It's absolutely crap. That movie is worthless it's worthless that's got that's all i've got to say thank you for the people on facebook and thank you from the people on um the people on instagram thank you so much thank you thank you thank you so much hold on, i'm just trying to close facebook um let me see what have i done yeah that's it i think i've done it I finish people on insta and uh, facebook thank you so much for joining seriously don't don't go and even give that movie publicity it's not worth giving movie publicity imagine if you have a girl child or a boy child and a, a, a director gave your child a script movie script to say what do you want to be when you grow up then that girl says i want to be a prostitute there is power in words that's power in words. You don't portray our girl child like that. Our girl, our girl, you don't do that. You're me Fabi, you don't do that. If you're not a father, I'm telling you as a mother, you don't do things like that. Words are very powerful. What message are you sending out? What sort of message are you sending out? What sort of, just because you and Yabo have this ongoing back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, 
then you cannot be the big man to let it slide and let the and let the uh, justice take its course. You just went to do movie just because you want to cash out. Is that what it's all about? Cashing out. Because that movie absolutely makes no sense. It makes no sense. It makes no sense. Go, go to Instagram, go to Facebook and see. It makes no sense. Nobody is even applauding you for that movie. The only people that are applauding you for that movie is those perpetrators. That's all. Because that movie makes no sense. That's it, guys. All right, guys. Have a great night, people. Have a great night, people. All right, then. Bye.